What's up, Fit Gamers? Joey B, Splash 3 here, back again with your fight scene breakdown. We're taking a look at, again, the Raid 2, the kitchen fight scene there at the end. This is part two. It gets crazy in this one. So you've seen there from the reenactment, this fight scene gets very intense very quickly here. We're still in the empty hand uh, portion of this fight scene. Krambits come in later on. But right here, we got the assassin coming in with a front kick and two punches immediately. So basically a three strike combo and Rama just counters with some blocks and parries. He goes, bam, wow, wow. Rama starts for his counter. He comes with a straight right, boom. The assassin parries that and comes on in with a outside forearm shot right there. Rama stops that and captures the arm right there. Rama follows up by going underneath and goes for a reverse elbow. The bad guy just uses his hand to stop that strike from coming through. Now Rama twists that around, twists his arm, gets him in an arm lock and throws an elbow strike. The bad guy uses his other hand there, stops that elbow strike from coming in forearm to forearm. He's gonna come over the top, get rid of this grip, boom, bring this down, and he's gonna come with a vertical elbow right here. Then he's gonna go over the top with horizontal strikes, and Rama's gonna duck coming underneath, boom. And this is where the bad guy goes for another inner forearm shot here. Rama's gonna block with his left hand and come underneath with his right to get an arm lock in here. He's gonna come underneath and grab the elbow and bang, he's gonna turn that into an arm lock. The assassin counters by circling his arm around and capturing this wrist of Rama to bring him into a chicken wing lock right here behind his back. Rama counters with a reverse elbow coming down on the downward diagonal line. The bad guy is simply just going to put up his arm and block the elbow from striking him in the head. After the assassin defends that elbow strike, Rama clears, turns around. The bad guy comes here with a quick right elbow straight to his body. Rama counters by hitting forearm to forearm here. Then the assassin goes for a quick sweep to that lead leg. Rama sees it coming, counters by stepping up and gets ready for a spinning sidekick straight to the ribs. Boom. The bad guy is gonna try to hit him with a reverse elbow as he hits him right there in the ribs. As the assassin's backpedaling, Rama follows him in with a nice combination, basically a one-two, a left-right with straight punches. The bad guy is going to counter by basically doing a windshield wiper with his front hand and then gives him a quick back fist straight to the temple. Boom, boom, bam, right there. Right after that back fist from the assassin, now Rama's backpedaling. So the assassin runs up to him, gives him a straight punch, he parries with the left, and then ducks under this backhand chop right here. Boom. Following that, the assassin comes with an elbow strike to the head. Rama blocks, and then he goes with a hammer fist. Bang, Rama blocks again. Now he goes for a low shot to the midsection. Boom, and then again to the high line here. Rama just blocks those two shots and counters them real quick. Right after this hook shot's countered, the bad guy goes for a front thrust kick here. Rama sidesteps that to the inside and captures it. Now the bad guy wants to get to the outside here, so he maneuvers his knee, brings it down and around to get it to this side so he can trap that leg. He 
traps him on the arm, and then literally grabs him by the throat. Now it's time for the choke slam. So after that choke slam right there on the table, Rama starts to get up. The assassin comes in and tries to get close. Rama strikes his knee right there with his elbow. Bam! Breaking his structure and bringing him down to the ground. Assassin quickly counters by throwing that hook kick on the ground. Rama ducks under that one, but then he gets a solid thrust kick right here to the chest from the assassin. Boom! So a few things we really liked about this fight scene was that it was counter for counter, right? These guys are going back and forth. They're pretty much equally matched. Not one fighter is getting the main advantage in this exchange here that we showed you guys. We also liked how after that slam onto that table, he's got that elbow shot to the knee. This is where you see some of the staples of C-Lot, those low line attacks from the crouching positions to the legs, and then those kicks from that uh, kneeling or sitting position right here and then especially right there it's very common to see those in sila and i really like how they put that into the choreography of this fight scene one of the more flashy parts of the fight scene that i didn't really like was where rama does this spin move after that elbow and throws that big wide elbow i mean there's a lot of time that happens right there and again yeah he could be wrenching his arm right here as he spins to get him to you know be in an arm lock right here but it's really easy to get out of stuff like this and just be ready for that incoming elbow or just to, you know, I'm in my arm lock, right? Just a counter right there at the knee or if he doesn't get me in a good enough arm lock or my skin is slippery or the clothes are tear tearing or whatever, just give him a quick thrust kick right there to break off of that. Again, that flashy stuff is for entertainment. This is a great fight scene, but we want to discuss some of those things. Let me know in the comments below what your favorite part of this fight scene was or a part that you did not like so we can, you know, have a chat with you guys in the comments. Thanks to Chris for helping me out with this one. Again, we're going to be going through this fight scene. There's probably going to be like 10 parts to this one because it's so long and detailed, but we're going to keep chugging on through it. Be sure to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any other videos in the future. Be sure to head on over to the Patreon page. Show us your love over there. We can really use your support. It helps us with the production you know, woes of YouTube creators such as us right here. And it really just helps us out getting some gear, getting some props for these videos so we can have some awesome content for you guys. So thank you all so much. As always, game on, stay fit, and keep on training, guys. We'll see you guys in the next fight scene break. Hiya! Hiya! Really like that sidekick. That sidekick. He nailed me in the ribs a few times. I mean, we did a lot of takes of that. Yeah. He nailed me right in the ribs. Feels good still. Feels good. They're powerful. If you can catch somebody with them. Done! You know what you can catch somebody usually with? Is a quick eye jab. Ding!